And this blossoming scandal sure to be on the minds of many as the Romulus City Council meets tonight. Our coverage continues with 7 Action News investigator Bill Proctor. And Bill, what a meeting for this evening. <laughs> Yes, there could be a number of explosions. Already we're hearing that one person, longtime council member, has announced uh, his intention to run for the mayor's seat. All of a sudden announcing today that he is uh, no longer uh, either protecting the mayor or no longer supporting him, at least. In the meantime, you've still got Alan Lambert, who may or may not show up tonight. The bet is that he won't show up here, uh, mainly because there's still a lot of explaining to do. Just what was it that sent the Michigan State Police to his home just a week ago uh, tonight? Apparently spending at least 12 hours there collecting a number of documents. And yes, there are so many rumors about what's happening there that there were discussions today about the real possibility that the mayor was, in fact, cleaning out his office. Uh, not true, says a number of people on the inside. And so with that in mind, uh, tonight there will be explosives, at least coming from some of the mouths of some of the council people, talking about why they think the mayor should in fact step down, take a leave of absence, resign, simply get out of the way until this Michigan State Police investigation either uh, steps up with some charges or is explained by someone, including the mayor himself. So tonight at 7.30, it will in fact start right here here in the council chambers at City Hall. Reporting live in Romulus, Bill Proctor, 7 Action News.